All right, here is my dilemma. I have a riding mower that every time I try to engage the mowing deck, the mower chokes down and turns off. Let me show you what we've got. It's an older Craftsman GS6500. Has the Kohler 26 horsepower engine. And here's the battery. It's the Walmart Everlast battery. And it's only two years old. But I've been having a problem with it. Every time I engage the mowing deck, as you can see, I have an engage and disengage switch. Engages and disengages the mowing deck. I can get the mower to crank. It's a little hard to crank, but I can get it to crank. But even after it's running, if I engage the mowing deck, it chokes down. Well, I checked all my spindles, and you can't really see it so much, but all the spindles turned free. I went ahead and greased all my spindles. I even took the clutch, the PTO clutch, which is under here. Don't know if you can see it. I'll try to get a better picture of it. But anyway, the main drive clutch, that's what engages and disengages. I took that thing apart. Couldn't find a problem with it. Couldn't find a problem with any of the spindles. Everything seems to be turning good and free. But when I engage it, it chokes down. Well, I got to thinking, maybe I don't have a mechanical problem. Maybe I have an electrical problem. Well, I put a charger on the battery, and I charged this battery overnight, and it still wouldn't take a full charge. So now I'm thinking that the reason that my mowing deck chokes down my engine is because I need a new battery. Let's see if that's the problem. All right, here's the new battery. The old battery, even after charging it for 24 hours, was only reading like 11.9 volts. This is the brand new battery. Disconnected, not running, 12.72. And also on the new battery, more cold cranking amps. My old battery was 275, this one is 340. Maybe it should have always been 340. All right, new battery installed. Let's see if she'll crank. All right, she cranked up. With it running, so the alternator is definitely putting out. It was a bad battery all along. If it bogs your lawnmower down, it may not be a mechanical problem. Check all the mechanical stuff first, but it could be your battery. Thanks for watching. See ya.